So you might be in a weird situation where for some reason you keep getting this loop inside of your Google Android phone, basically just keeps telling you that's checking for information. Now this can happen for a few different reasons, but the number one reason why this ends up happening is because you're not giving it that much time for it to go ahead and actually check the information on your phone. So what I would recommend doing here is just giving it a few moments, even a few minutes. It can take a lot of time sometimes. I've been in this situation where it can take like a um, couple minutes, which is insane. Now that was basically for older Android phones. The newer ones are probably much better. But what I would probably recommend doing here is going through and giving it a few minutes, giving it a few moments, not doing anything super wild, and then probably a little bit later going in, and then it'll probably fix itself. However, if that's not working, you want to quadruple check your internet connection on your phone. So if you have the ability of going past the setup and actually you know, going into certain devices, just double check that you're able to get internet access. You can see that I'm able to Google whatever this issue was. You want to check your internet access, and if you're able to access internet on your phone, then that's fine. The next thing you want to do is make sure that the credentials that you gave for your Google account were actually proper, and they were actually the real you know, credentials of the account that you want to go and use. So sometimes when people are putting in account information, they may mistype, they may type in wrong things. So sometimes if that happens to you, then go ahead and just double check that that's not the issue. So go ahead and just double check that that's not the issue, and that can probably end up fixing the problem too. Now, if for some reason that still isn't working, but you're still able to go through the initial setup and you're able to you know, have internet access, what I'd probably recommend doing here is going straight into your settings of your Android phone. So click on settings right here, scroll down until you see system, and then scroll down again until you see system update, which is right here, and go ahead and see if you have an update available for your Android phone. And that's another option that you have on top of that as well. So those are pretty much the main ways to go and do it for the most part. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.